Hello everyone, this is David Pensick, Communications Manager for Sklo Library. And for this edition of Librarian's Cut, I want to talk about three films that you can find on the video streaming services that you have access to with your Sklo Library card. These are three documentaries, and the reason I'm tying them together, they each deal with a beverage I enjoy. One deals with coffee, one deals with beer, and one deals with wine. But there's also a great theme that is thread throughout uh, that is present in each of the movies, and that's just people following their passion, following their dreams, regardless of the obstacles they face, whether it's a financial obstacle, whether it's an outside entity being a, uh, providing a challenge. They're, they want to go ahead with the this passion they have for creating the beverages that I mentioned. And the first is Barista, and you can find this on Canopy. And this follows, starts out following four and eventually five people who are competing at the 2015 Barista National Championships in Boston. And just the precision and the, the creativity that goes into making coffee from each of these baristas is, is pretty impressive. They have to make three drinks in 15 minutes for a panel of judges. They have to make an espresso, a cappuccino, and then a signature drink where they can do a lot of different things fruit, chocolate, and these drinks, but and some other things that you'll find out. So that's Barista, and that's on Canopy. On Hoopla, you can find Beer Wars, and this is a really great look at the challenges that craft brewers in this country face when trying to compete with the big beer makers like Anheuser-Busch, Coors, and Miller, just in terms of getting noticed on the shelves. You know, the big beer makers take up so much space on the grocery store shelves that it's tough for the craft brewers to find space to get noticed. And you'll learn about the three-tiered system, the, how beer gets distributed in this country and some of the unfairness that is to craft uh, brewers. Uh, Dogfish Head in Delaware, they're kind of a big craft brewer. They're featured in this film pretty prominent, prominently. Yingling, America's oldest uh, beer maker, they're in Pennsylvania, so some Pennsylvania love in this movie. It, they're also spotlighted. So that's Beer Wars, you can find that on Hoopla. And also on Hoopla is American Wine Story. And the centerpiece of this movie is a man named Jimmy Brooks. He founded Brooks Winery in Oregon. He died several years ago from a heart attack, and he left the winery to his young son. And but interspersed within that, and they keep going, they keep going back to that story. But then they also talk to these other winemakers, mostly in the Pacific Northwest, in Oregon, in Washington, but other parts of the country as well. Just how people, their love of wine, led them to become winemakers, grow, grow their own, uh, uh, start up a vineyard that some people left great paying jobs to pursue this. Um, a sports fan, it was uh, interesting to see Drew Bledsoe, former NFL quarterback. He's now a winemaker in Washington. They keep going back to the Brooks Winery and show the close-knit community of these winemakers, but then also talking to, to how people got started in winemaking. And Jimmy Brooks' son at the end of the film has a great line that I think also ties in all these, these movies together. He said, I'm not, I'm paraphrasing, I think he said, I'm not afraid of dying, I'm afraid of not living. And I think that's also another theme that is prevalent in these three films. So that's uh, uh, Barista on Canopy and Beer Wars and American Wine Story and Hoopla. So enjoy.